Uh, ben Rouge in New Orleans mean everything to me. Um, beyond, I was literally born on campus at LSU. I went to school there. Um, I already knew pretty much I was going there. You know, it was just destined for me. And then you know, my mom got the coaching job at Tulane, and that's really where I grew up. That's where I had my childhood. Um, New Orleans is, is my home, and it's a uh, it's got a place in my heart forever. When I got to LSU, I felt like I was freed, and it allowed me to grow really into, you know, the person I am today. And you know, it's college, and, and that's where you really learn and find out about yourself. That's where you kind of find in your way as a man. Death Valley. Ooh, it's one of the craziest atmospheres uh, that you could ever play in. And, and just for that to be my home and to go there every every week and walk down the hill and walk into the stadium and be able to um, be a part of such a great team, great program, um, and great atmosphere, I, I'm thankful for those moments. You know, I always tell people I'd give up an NFL game check to play one game in Death Valley. Um, the atmosphere was really like that, so it, it's definitely really where I found myself. I remember the first ever touchdown I had was in Tiger Stadium against Kentucky. My Freshman year, and it was probably one of my craziest touchdowns that I've had. I caught the ball as soon as I landed. I made somebody miss, and then I literally cut back across the entire field. I remember running up um, for my first touchdown in that stadium, and, and the crowd just going crazy. I was really addicted to that feeling ever since then. Scoring in Death Valley, I mean, the way that the fans are, the the, the band, the atmosphere. Words don't even do it justice for you know the, the feelings that I was having. A lot of those moments, you know, strengthened me as a man. Uh, a lot of failures, a lot of losses, whatever you want to call it, um, really evolved me to be who I am now.